Okay, thank you. Mm, I'll start with some uh, few, few, few slides. Okay, uh, yes. Can I say, uh, okay. Uh, hello everyone. Uh, my name is Andrzej Bacz. I'm from uh, uh, Academic Computer Center Cypronet uh, based in Krakow. Uh, I'm a UX uh, user experience and user interface designer, and I'm pleased to, uh, to be here and show you some live demo uh, how to access and use resources through the marketplace. Uh, before I will do that, uh, I want to uh, I want to show what uh, points, uh, uh, what kind of points we will uh, we will talk about. Uh, so before we access the resource, we need to uh, find uh, find one. <laughs> so I will start from uh, quick discovering resources using uh, EOSC uh, marketplace and catalog. Then I will uh, then I will tell something about how to narrowing um, uh, results uh, using categories, filters, and search uh, functionality functionality. Uh, uh, after that, uh, I need to uh, I need to talk about the type of resources which you can get here, here in the marketplace. Uh, I also uh, I also give a notice about the user projects, which is I think it is a nice uh, functionality functionality which will help you uh, in managing resources uh, ordered uh, through the marketplace. Uh, of course, we will talk about how to access these resources, and last but not least, uh, I will talk about and giving and getting a feedback from uh, EOS Marketplace. So this was a quick slide. So let's start our live demo. Mm, I need to switch to the browser. Uh, okay, I I think that everything's now 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 it's uh, now it's okay. You you can see my browser and starting. A page which is of course the EOS portal of EU. So I I can imagine that you, that you know that the catalog and marketplace is findable here from the top navigation. So we can uh, so we can go there. And uh, I need to say is some some words about the starting page landing page because if you want to browse uh, if you want to browse resources inside inside marketplace we have a few possible path to, to achieve it. So uh, first of all, we can browse through whole catalog without any, any narrowing any, any data, any, any results. But if we are sure and if we, and if we know the, the and, and if we know our scientific domains, we can, uh, we can use this kind with this kind of filters and entering into the marketplace using our scientific domains or if we want also a categories because every resource has a position uh, inside some categories which i will uh, talk it about it later uh, of course if you are similar to some communities and infrastructure resources and you know that uh, and you know the providers of course you can also use use this blue box which you uh, directly show you resources from providers or communities and infrastructure uh, infrastructures Le but let's assume and uh, ah so sorry for that um, i i forgot to, to add it uh, of course we can also um, we can also use um, a link to the projects about the projects i will say uh, say it later but assume that i need to discover some uh, for example, uh, my colleague told me that, for example, EU that ha has a great resource which which is something similar with uh, registering research data. So I want to find it here in marketplace. So I browse through the catalog. Okay, uh, where the new screen, where the new 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 page new page appear with a resource list on the right, and of course the uh, some filters and some additional. Uh, Functional, uh, functionalities on the uh, left side. Uh, first, uh, first, and I think maybe not the most important, but important are the categories. We have a, a structure tree inside these categories because we have a, a main categories, which are uh, 
uh, which have uh, inside some subcategories and so on. So we can dive into these categories and try to find something interested, interesting here. So we don't really know from what kind of categories is, is uh, uh, resources which we, are, which we are looking for, but we know that it's provided by UDAT. So I try to use the filters here. Uh, we can, we can filter in the resources through the scientific domains, providers, uh, related infrastructures and platforms, rating, for example, order type, which we, ha which we have a couple. So I, I'm noticed and I will talk it about it later. Uh, but we know that we need to find, but we know that the uh, uh, that is a provider of this data. So we can narrow in the, 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 the result list. And this is our, of course, result. Uh, so we are not pretty sure which kind, which uh, what kind of resources we need to we need to check. But we know that um, that the resource that the resources it's something similar to the research data. Some uh, the colleague told us that some uh, that we know that there is some handle word. So we can use also in a in a easy easy way a search a search box. Search box, search box, search box will uh, uh, will find any any keywords inside the resource uh, resource detailed page involving also offers because uh, resource can uh, can has uh, can has many offers inside them. So maybe uh, so I know that is you that and it is, there is a keyword handle or something like that. So we have a tip. Uh, during during typing the keywords, we have uh, some uh, some tips uh, below. Uh, I didn't find any interesting, so I'm trying to uh, search it. Sorry, so sorry for that. I need to do something like that. Oh, okay. Uh, sorry for this inc inc inconvenience. Uh, so. Uh, so we have uh, oh so the first result I think this is the, this is this is what I'm looking for but I also want to uh, notice you that something like this here on the list we have something like suggested resources suggested resources are based are based on our uh, uh, reco uh, re recommend system because we are trying to guess or we are trying to learn your. Uh, 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 your specific maybe specific domain or what is important for you during the search it's uh, this uh, this recommender system using it uh, try to track uh, your your path inside the marketplace and try and try to give you as more comfortable or more important information which can be useful in your researches uh, we, I, I want also to um, I want I want also to add that the suggested uh, resources are also based on your profile uh, because on your profile which is uh, which is uh, available when you are logged in because if you want to access to every resource in an, uh, in marketplace you need to be logged in unfortunately unfortunately but. Uh, 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 but I think it's an easy part because uh, we are using an uh, SSO single sign uh, sign -all, uh, authentication. So I think that your provider is also here and can uh, and and can give you an access through this through this uh, through our uh, through uh, through this uh, login page. So as as I mentioned before, the recommender system also based on your profile. Which is which is available from this from this navigation, and here you can put uh, your category on interest and scientific domains, uh, and this information is get uh, get uh, get and proceed by our recommended system and try to show you sorry and try to show you uh, some uh, some maybe interesting resources here, but let's back to our EU that. And handle. Mm, uh, uh, okay, uh, I found the B B two handle uh, B B two handle, which I think it's interesting for me. And as I and, and as I uh, as we see here, this uh, resource have many resource offers with different types. These types of uh, resources and these types of offers are are also visible here on a 
uh, resource detail page, if it exists, of course, and also on the list, which we can see here. Uh, we have, as I mentioned before, we have uh, different types, uh, different types of uh, resources. Why? Uh, because not every resource need to, you, you don't need to accessing directly through, for example, through the provider to use these resources. Because, for example, these resources uh, are the part of I don't know some website uh, of some information which is not. A, 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 which is not uh, covered by EOS marketplace because we are all, only informing about it. Uh, so maybe I, using this B2 handle, I will say something more about uh, about uh, uh, about uh, uh, types uh, of resources. Uh, we have in marketplace we have five uh, five uh, five types of uh, uh, of resources. One of them is fully open access which it means that resource can be used without any constraints. So we can, so we can, for example, maybe I can show you. Uh, we can, we can, uh, we can use, we can use it, uh, or the required fully open access, 3D Bionis WS. During access the resource, we have an information about what kind of also um, remember what kind of type of resources this is and we have a possibility to go to this resource when i click to this to this link i uh, uh, the new page appear with with this resource we have also the second step in this access which i will uh, talk it, uh, talk it about it later but let's back to the b to handle Okay, one of them is open uh, is uh, open access, fully open access. Second type is open access, uh, where no ordering procedure uh, procedure is necessary to access this resource. We have uh, order requ required uh, resource, so this kind of resource is managed and uh, managed uh, manage, uh, through the mar marketplace. And this, this kind of uh, resource we will, act, we, we, we will access in the next step. Uh, and we also have um, um, other, uh, other type of uh, resources where we, where we put other unclassified um, 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 order type, which we can't manage. And also we have an information like here uh, from B2 handle that we have various order types because inside this resource, uh, we have an offers which can, uh, which can be used like open access or order required. Uh, what next? Before we access the resource, I want to show you another path how to manage your resources and how to explore or maybe what kind of help you can get from EOSC Marketplace. I need to change instance uh, to beta instance because in this uh, on the produc production side, unfortunately, I have some projects inside that. So it, it will be not clear maybe for, new, for newcomers uh, and uh, some information will be missed. So I, I switch to beta uh, Marketplace. Uh, and using a link, go to your projects. Okay, let's go there. Of course, we, I need to be logged in. Mm, okay, let's uh, let's uh, uh, this page up here where where we have something like onboarding and what kind of functionality is user projects. Uh, uh, user projects uh, directly means that you, that this is the place when you can organize your resources. Uh, it's based. Uh, uh, it's a collection of uh, preferable resources. Here you can monitor ordering status, and last but not least, you can contact with project support. Why? I will explain. Because we have a one situation when uh, when you are. When, when you are maybe sure, you, you, are, you are pretty sure that what kind of resources do you need? So you are exploring, browsing the marketplace and you are checking and ordering and accessing. Uh, and you want to ordering some, uh, some, uh, some concrete uh, resource. But if you are not pretty sure and you are, if you are not pretty sure uh, what kind of resources you will need, you, 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 can't, you, you, you can't create this 
project. Uh, sorry for sorry for that. Uh, it's better I need to log out because it's not. <laughs> sorry, uh, it's not uh, covered my uh, my path. Mm, okay, let's go to your uh, project. Okay. Uh, we, I can uh, I can create I can I can create a new project and what's it important? We can create the test test project and the second field is very is very interesting and interesting and important because here you can describe what kind of researches you want to you want to do. Uh, you can explain for yourself and maybe for for support what kind uh, what kind of resources you. Uh, you, you should get or, 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 you, or, or you, what kind of your resources you, you you need to get. So here, sorry, sorry to that, I will not cover this field. Uh, for example, there's there is a whole story behind this behind this uh, behind this uh, field. Uh, it's also important to check what kind of scientific domains uh, uh, I, I went. Okay, some additional information is uh, the, the, it's not important here, and also it's uh, is also, and also it's important what kind of uh, what kind of customer user I am. So I am single user, so I need to fill my affiliation. Uh, I'm from Cyphernet. Oh yeah, I'm from Cyphernet. Uh, Cyphernet, uh, all, of course, Poland uh, is here, and the also. Uh, website is uh, is also available. So I'm not a robot. So I'm creating a new new project. And here in 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 this place, the projects are available from this uh, from this navigation. We have the project details. But this is what we filled in a second second ago. Here is the place where the resources appear. And the third one is the contact with project support. If we if if we will have any problem with resources or we don't know what what kind of resources do we maybe do we need or everything what is what is connected with with that what we were um, filled in this uh, in this form before uh, I'm I'm talking about the description of uh, of our researchers we can ask. Our uh, our guy, uh, which can which will help you, uh, which will help you in this uh, in in this way. So in some something like a chat. But uh, if you have a problem, please use the contact with project support. Okay, so we have the one path where we are browsing the resources uh, and uh, freely. And we have this path with uh, project support. I suggest to use this project, this project, because in the access uh, you, uh, during the uh, accessing the resources, there will be a question where to put the new resources to default project or for some, or to the uh, new, new one. So using uh, using this uh, uh, add your first resource button, and then marketplace. I think so. The marketplace will uh, remember what kind of project is now default, so we can go to B to handle. Okay. Okay. We we want to access this resource. Access this resource. We have different, but we but we select an order required. On every step, we have an information. We want to. From from my perspective, from my user experience, uh, the perspective, um, every step should be should should have a good descriptions what's going on, and I think we we did that uh, using using this content. So on every steps, you will be notice what kind of resources, what kind of type of resources uh, you will get, and what you should do with 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 that. So. It, I think it will be very helpful. So we know that this is the resources which need to be under ordered through the marketplace. So okay, let's go next. There's some so with uh, with this kind uh, in um, in this kind uh, resources we have some configuration. So it it will be random here if our uh, like demo purposes. Uh, private provider, okay. Let's get serve number of bits. Uh, One hundred is enough. Okay, so next final details. 
Okay, so we have some uh, have some up here. And also we have a question about the projects because we start from this project with what is called the test project. So, so this is our default project now. So the system um, uh, give us an information that this resource will be managed in this for, for, for somehow folder, which is called test, test project. Now we, we can check if this is this is what what we want. Uh, this is the place where, where we want to put these resources. Of course, from this step, we all, we can also add a new project, but we don't need to do that now. Okay, we are still. I am still not a robot. Okay, and send and send access request. Okay, great. So we we are back in this test project. Uh, the, the place folder, oh, and we have an information about about the resources which we were uh, which we have uh, had access the second uh, seconds ago. So we have an information that this is the new <laughs> new 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 resource with these par parameters. Uh, okay, this is, is, is uh, this is the summary with order and another information. Uh, of course, and we have the order history tab up here. So here we are informed that the, our resources request has been created, and now we can we need to wait for a provider response. Of course, if the, if there will be any problem with this resource, we can also contact with resource provider. So this is the, the it's it's almost um, similar to the contact with um, support, but don't uh, don't be afraid to to, 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 to use uh, this functionality. And here is if there is a problem with, with resource, you can have a contact through the marketplace with, with provider. You don't need to you don't need to go to provider and and uh, and mail him directly. Of course, we can back to the project services. Where the B two handle B two handle uh, uh, appear, we have a notice uh, through the dot that, that the status is new, and we need to and we need to wait for uh, provider response. Uh, of, of course, the project project can be edited. We, we can we can change uh, we can change almost everything uh, here. Uh, and this is the purpose of uh, and this is the purpose of uh, uh, of projects. I want to show you how how it looks like when you have a lot of a lot of resources here. So this is this is this is my resources. It says, uh, some of them are not available because I uh, uh, I stop I stop use, using it. Okay, I have some information. Oh. Maybe I don't. <laughs> I don't have one. But what? What also? The, what I want also um, uh, aware aware you because some 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 of these resources, as I said, are order required. So here and some of them are uh, open access. So it's mean I I, I want to remember you. So it's mean they are available available uh, outside the marketplace. For example. Uh, for example, Haddock. If we if we if we type the Haddock here, it's a web portal, uh, and we and we want to access uh, to this resource, and it's fully open access. We can go to this resource. We are notice that we if we add this to the to the project, this this kind of resource that we gain that we will gain EOS expert support. So it's at least. Um, and it, it it will be it will be put inside this project because in the next step, accessing this uh, resource, we only need to put this to the pro appropriate appropriate project. But as I mentioned before, this kind of resources uh, are treated here in marketplace as a bookmarks. Uh, I will uh, interrupt. Okay, I will back to the projects. Uh, are treated as a bookmark, so we can use it outside the marketplace uh, but these resources are also connected with our project so we have a, a full view the full view to what kind of resources we are using inside this project even if there are some kind uh, some kind of uh, somehow they are um, uh, like uh, bookmarks uh, okay so i think that we cover it 
the information about how to access how to access uh, resources and the last thing which i want to uh, which i want to show you is giving and giving and getting uh, feedback because where during using uh, resources inside the marketplace we we have a possibility inside the resource which we have ordered we can review this kind of resource uh, if if uh, if if it will take a, a little time that this uh, functionality appear because we don't want to um, uh, re reviewing uh, uh, resources uh, seconds uh, after we order it so this functionality will appear in, in in some in some perspective so we can review the resource and reviewing resources is, is uh, uh, i think it's um, uh, maybe not it's important for, 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 for from one side uh, are important for other user because based on the reviews we are also can uh, recommend resources based on reviewing so so uh, uh, so so please use it why not uh, and the second and the second uh, and the second my thought was uh, to giving uh, giving a feedback in another uh, in another under another way it's it's here it's it's this is badge it's my uh, my love badge uh, provide feedback because if you if you have any problem with uh, technical problem with marketplace, of course you can you can give us an feedback uh, using report the technical problem. But if you have any questions about using marketplace, if something it's not uh, if you are not similar to some functionalities and so on so on so on, and you can give us a feedback, please use this provide feedback. I'm reading with our colleagues these tickets, and we try to improving marketplace uh, every, every every day for better. Uh, for uh, and we want to make a place for um, for, for a place for uh, for your researchers. And we are we are really like to hear about uh, uh, about the questions about innovation about um, uh, any solution which you can provide to us. And I'm not sure, yes, I think this is the end. It was quite quick, I think so. So I want to, I want to say uh, thank you. And I'm very pleased, uh, pleased that I uh, were here. And please enjoy <laughs> getting resources from Marketplace. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much, work. Um... So I think we uh, concluded the presentation with this. Uh, Luigi is not going to, to speak uh, as far as I understand. Okay, uh, so I'll uh, stop the recording.